Thousands of years ago, on a sand dune, on this island, a rare mammoth laid itself down to rest for the last time. Mammoths, which are thought to be prehistoric elephants, once roamed North America. But only on these islands did the pygmy or dwarf mammoth evolve. Its existence is as much a mystery as its disappearance. How did they get here? What caused their extinction? Little is known for certain. But four people want to change that. They hope to unearth a complete skeleton of a pygmy mammoth. Something that, to this day, has never been done. In August 1994, four scientists leave Ventura, California en route to Santa Rosa Island, the second largest of the Channel Islands. The team of scientists hope to be the first to excavate a complete skeleton of a pygmy or dwarf mammoth. The fascination with prehistoric elephants is centuries old. In 1797, Thomas Jefferson sent out a call for a complete skeleton of a mammoth. At the time, only scattered remnants had been collected. A great number of explorers set out to fulfill his wishes. All failed. Now, some 200 years later, these four scientists are embarking on a journey to answer Thomas Jefferson's call. Don Morris is a National Park Service archaeologist stationed on the Channel Islands. For this excavation, he called on the leading mammoth experts in the country. Larry Agenbrod is a paleontologist uh, with considerable experience and expertise in this species, in mammoth. I'm really intrigued that, you know, of all the people who could have found this animal, that Tom Rockwell found it, because he was studying the geology the, the context in which this animal was found. Louise Roth is also involved in the project, and she is one of the leading mammoth biologists in the country. Uh, she's probably measured more pygmy mammoth bones than any other person alive. After a three-hour boat trip, the excavation team arrives at Santa Rosa Island. This critter has been my life ever since Tom found it, uh, just before the 4th of July. And you know, this is the payoff. We got people here. We're starting to work. Uh, it's all coming together. And I, I've been ecstatic ever since we got on the island. Uh, we couldn't just say, oh, gee, that's nifty. We found this. Let's take a picture and go home and write up a report. This was something that we had to react to. It's sitting on the slope, it's weathering, it's vulnerable to damage. Uh, it's vulnerable to vandalism. We thought this has to come out right away. Well, this means going home and finding the money right at the end of the fiscal year uh, to get a project together to do this, getting the people to do it, uh, making it all come together. <laughs> 